May you have abundance. May you have love and all of the good stuff in your life. Fire people, fire people, okay, fire people, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, okay, Oh, wow. Okay, fire people. The first one is Leo. Leo. It's like you almost thought the ending of a chapter, but you got it upside down, basically meaning the opposite. The ending of the chapter, you're slowing down what you wanted to finish. Now you're slowing down what you wanted to finish. You not You didn't think it was going to be that way. Um, I think you thought about it too much. You thought about something too much. It's not really working the way you thought it was. Okay. And um, uh, for the females, the females for some reason, or the males, the females or the males. Okay. If this is you, Leo, this is how you feel. You feel creative. Okay. It, it could be a male or a female. You feel very creative. You are doing what you want to do, regardless of the world being upside down. But at the same time, Leo, you're almost waiting for battle. Okay, you're almost waiting for battle. Like, what happened that's keeping you so guarded? What's happening to keep you so guarded? Um, hmm. I'm just wondering what's happening to keep you so guarded. Okay, three of wands. There's a creativity. Your ship's your ship is is ready to sail away, right? Good things are gonna happen, but you're having a lot of fear. Um something with mm, something almost with children, having to do with children and monies, you know, either paybacks. You know, for Leo, uh, this is for Leo, okay? The same time you are worried sick. You're worried sick. And you want to almost sleep it away here with the Palace of Swords. However, this too will pass and good things will come forward, okay? Good things are going to come through Leo's, okay? Let's pick up a hidden oracle for you to clear this up for you. A hidden oracle. And this is what I should have done with the other one, with my other cards. This is the hidden oracle. What's hidden oracle for Leo? Whoa, this came up. 
I will wait for you for a sign from you. Okay, I will wait for a sign from you. Okay, this Leo is tired. Tired of, I guess, Leo is tired of extending themselves. Okay, they want to know if this is a good time. A good time for the project. A good time for uh, this love to be real. Rather, they feel this person promised them something, but at the same time, they're holding back. Okay, this person is holding back. Therefore, Leo uh, is thinking the worst things because he, he's been there, done that. Whether you're male or female, uh, there's a kid involved. Okay, whether it's your kid, whether it's her or his, or whatever. So you're feeling guarded, Leo. You're feeling guarded. My dog is snoring. Or my baby, my fur baby, she's snoring. Uh, although your ship is is coming, your ship is coming, but at the same time, with the Nine of Swords, it's 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 going to be there. Man, you're waiting. You have hope. I will wait for a sign from you. So you want that person to make up their mind in its entirety. This is what I'm seeing. Okay. This is. Okay, this is what I'm seeing. I, I was just hearing some noise from the outside as well. I'm sorry. Okay, so the next one that came to my mind was Sagittarius. Okay, Sagittarius. Okay, your world seems like it's going upside down, Sagittarius. You know, uh, you're almost going backwards. You're going backwards, but at the same time, you're okay with it. Some of you, Some of you may not be okay with it. Okay, some of you know that your life is going to turn around. Some of you are feeling it, but at the same time, Sagittarius, you are you are watching, you are guarding yourself for dear life. You're guarding yourself for dear life, and you're truly protecting yourself. You feel like you are the king of wands. You are the king of wands, but you're scared. Something's keeping you afraid, or not afraid, but you're almost dreaming about certain things, and you're you're almost daydreaming, but someone is going to come along, Sagittarius. Someone is going to come along, especially if you're a female. Someone is going to come along, and your nights won't be that bad. Someone is going to come along. Once again, it could be somebody from the past that could come along. It's probably... Mm, you're you're not sure. This is uncertainty. I'm feeling uncertainty, Sagittarius. I'm feeling uncertainty. And I'm seeing you sharing this with a young person at the same time. You sharing some of your business with a young person. Because you don't know what to do, really. Uh, you don't know what to do. You're okay. But at the same time, subconsciously, there's something going on there. Okay, this is what I'm vibing with Sagittarius, all right? Okay, so this is what I'm, I'm I'm vibing. I can't really vibe more. I just feel the three things I feel more with the Sagittarius is like you feel like you got to protect yourself. You got to guard yourself. It's similar to Leo. You got to guard yourself. You feel you're you're getting you're almost getting in, into the state of narcissism or selfishness. I, I see that you're you're becoming selfish. You're becoming selfish and you're disregarding the positive qualities. Okay, the positive qualities, especially if you're a man. I'm picking up this more from men. Women are more subdued and more mm, not either here or there. Okay, but at the same time, females especially, they're protecting themselves. They're guarding themselves. They're not going to take no one's crap. Uh, not not throughout this year. They're, they're not going to take anything. You know, they're going to guard themselves. However, there's a doubt because they keep dreaming. You know, they keep having these dreams. But with the Knight of Swords, it's going to get, oh, it's, it's going to be okay. Okay? It's going to be okay. So that is what's for you, Sagittarius. Did I pull out a Hidden Truth Oracle? Let me pull out a Hidden Truth Oracle to see what else. 
is underneath all of this for uh, Sagittarius. Okay. Come on. Talk to me. What's underneath this for Sag? Either male or female. What's underneath it? Mm, this one is coming out. I'm so attracted to you. Okay, Sagittarius, this is what's going on. You are, you're in love almost. You are in love. I'm so attracted to you. Underneath all of this fear, all, underneath all this wanting to protect yourself, underneath all of this, the world seems, it's just, you're in love, but it's almost like... <sighs> Like a forbidden love. It's almost like a forbidden love. I'm so attracted to you. I am so attracted to you. This is what I'm vibing. Okay. So I hope you liked your reading. Sagittarius. I'm going. Oh, I'm not done. I still got Aries, right? Aries. Okay, Aries. What am I vibing from you, Aries? With the same cards because these, this is for fire. This is fire. Don't want to play with fire, right? This is for fire. Um, okay, Aries. Aries. You feel like someone lied to you. You feel like someone lied to you. And your world is upside down, except you don't tell nobody. Your world is upside down. You're turning me. No, it's it's not like that. It's not upside down. You're turning me. It's like I'm pissed. I'm truly, truly pissed because I thought this was one way, but it's not the way I thought it was going to be. You lied to me, okay? And I'm going to, I'm really guarding myself. I'm guarding myself. And this is you. You're focusing more on your career. This sounds a little bit like Scorpio too. This Aries in this this card right here, where um, like like the water signs I'm saying, and um, yeah, you're you're focusing more on your career, and you don't feel good. You don't feel good about it. You can't sleep. You can't sleep at night. You're afraid, but realize that this too shall pass. This will pass, Aries. This will pass. I mean. E e Subconsciously, there's a child that you're thinking about, Aries. Whether it's your own, whether it's somebody you adopted, but you're thinking about a child. Okay, this child is going through certain things that he sees you going through. He goes through the same thing. Okay, however, this too shall pass. You get a good card, which is the Knight of Swords. So this is going to pass, even though you feel like you were lied to. And your world is turned upside down because you thought something different. And this is what I'm getting for Aries. Now let's see what's hidden under the Oracle cards for Aries. This is it right here. I remember every detail of that day. Okay, this Aries cannot forget because you said something and she remembers everything or he remembers everything and he knows that you lied, period. I remember every detail of that day. Yeah. Aries feels, you know, I'm not saying all Aries, but if you have Aries moon, Aries... Sun, Aries rising, right? Okay. I am now going to do Capricorn, Earth signs. And I'll save the air for last as we breathe oxygen, right? Don't like to do these upside downs. I'm not the best upside down reader. I just read it the opposite way, right? I'm, I'm not an upside down reader. I'm not... The best reader in the world, I go through more of my um, intuition. The cards are just tools for me. Okay, I'm going to do the, the bowl again. And this is going to be 
for my earth people, my earth signs. May they have abundance and all the best to... Oh, my ears hurt with these glasses. May they have all the best for them throughout this year. Or the month, basically. For earth signs... Talk to me cards on um, these earth people. We're going to go with Capricorn first, right? No, we're going to pop up whichever one speaks to me. I can't say which one is going to talk to me first, right? Oh my God. That's the first card that popped up. That's about faith. Okay. That's the first card. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Oh, this is for Capricorn. Wow. Okay. Capricorn. This is, I vibe Capricorn right away. Okay. Capricorn. Have faith, Capricorn. You're going to have to have faith. You're going to have to have faith. Um, I see everything almost coming down. Everything that you build coming down. Okay. If, there was a fight already. There's like a, a, a seven of wands. Generally, five of wands are, um, you see the card. There's like a fight here. Seven of wands. You see that? Five of swords are, are the ones also that I generally gravitate toward fighting as well. But this is two. Seven of wands, like a battle, right? You're fighting and everything's coming down. And this is betrayal. This right here is betrayal. And this I picked for Capricorn, although this is for all the earth signs, okay? This is betrayal. This could be from a man. This could be a man, a dreamy man. Um, light skin, light eyes. And I see a breakdown. Everything's going to come down in order to rebuild itself. Um, he's like the magician or she's like the magician. Now you see me, now you don't. Now I change, now I don't. Okay, there's a, a child involved here. Okay, there's a child. Rather, it's your child, Capricorn. Okay, and they are seeing this. They are watching this. They don't like it. Although it may be from afar, they don't like it. Okay. Um, you are the empress. You got to carry yourself as one you're a strong person. You are the empress. You have the power. You're really very motherly, Capricorn. You're a very motherly, protective person. All right. This person is not seeing how valuable you are, and you're not seeing that either. Okay, this is what I'm I'm feeling for Capricorn. Okay, this is what I'm feeling for Capricorn. Betrayal, tears. Okay. Let's see an oracle card for cancers, for Capricorn, I'm sorry. What's underneath all this? Hidden truth. This one. My life is not as together as it seems. Exactly. This is what you're going through, Cancer, uh, Capricorn. Your life is not together 
My life is not as together as it seems. So Capricorns may be feeling that way right now. They're quiet about their business. They're not going to say anything. Some may say, you know, if, if they have Aries in their chart, they'll talk about it. You know, some may talk about, you know, oh my God, I almost took it down. I can't take it down because this is also a reading for the other fire signs. I mean, earth signs. Sorry. Okay. Virgo. Virgo. Virgo is also going through hardships. Virgo is not at peace. Virgo feels betrayed. Virgo feels betrayed. Everything seems to fall down for Virgo. Um, she feels betrayed by a man or he feels betrayed by a man as well. Everything is going down. She feels her health is going. He or she feels their health is going down. She feels like she's having problems in all directions, turbulent directions, he or she. Um, there's a child that sometimes they think about. They may be separated from this child. This is Virgo. And you feel like you were lied to. You feel like you were lied to. And you are the Empress, Virgo, just like Capricorn. You are the Empress. You got to carry yourself as one. Carry yourself as one. And although you... Um, you may not be considered as warm and loving. You are Virgo. You are Virgo, just like Capricorn, very motherly, very, very, um, grounded and also a money maker. You are the Empress. You are the Empress. And this is what I'm vibing. Okay. Let's see what's underneath it all, Virgo. Let's see what's underneath it all. Okay. I'm going to see what's underneath it. Virgo. Oh. It's kind of tight around my nose, these glasses. Okay, Virgo. This one. Okay, you may be thinking of someone or someone is thinking of you. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. This is what's a hidden truth behind Virgo. You may be thinking about a past love or he may be, he or she may be thinking about you, Virgo. This is what's underneath it all. Sometimes I lay awake thinking about you. Virgo, that is what I'm picking up for you. Okay, now to the sign of the other earth sign. What's the other earth sign? Taurus. Okay, Taurus. What's up with you, Taurus? Okay, you are keeping your faith first, Taurus. You are keeping your faith first, okay? You, okay, your world did come tumbling down and you fought through all this. You've been fighting through all this, okay? And um, you stood by that person regardless if he or she has cheated on you, okay? You stood beside that person, rather he or she has cheated. Okay, you stood by them. You stood by them. And um, I see like a pregnancy. I see that uh, it hasn't been easy for you, Taurus. You, you feel that um, you've wasted a lot of time in this relationship. Although you haven't been with this person a long time. Some may probably have been together with this person mm, probably not as long, I mean, under 20 years, that's, that would be the longest 20 years with this person. But I pick up like one year already and you feel like everything is tumbling down, but you're afraid. You're afraid of Taurus. You're afraid of being alone. You're afraid of being alone. Okay. You want that connection. You want that connection and wanting that connection. You want 
to give this person. You want this person, if, if you're a female, you want to get pregnant by this person. You want to have a baby. You want this relationship so bad. That's what you want. You have been having fights with this person. There has been problems with this person. However, um, just like the other two signs, you're not saying much, okay? Because you've been betrayed before in the past. Everything is tumbling down. But for some reason, for you, it tumbled down, but you got something good about it. Because so many people think the tower card is bad, but sometimes you have um, bad stuff that's got to, you know, come down before it can build up, right? Yeah, and I see pregnancy for you, Taurus. I see pregnancy. Don't know how soon you could have had an abortion. Uh, not, excuse me, not an abortion, but a miscarriage could have happened to you um, earlier this year. You could have had a miscarriage. It could have been due to the, you know what I'm talking about, right? Thing on the arm. Um, however, you'll be able to get pregnant if you are not, if you're not right now, you know. But something is going to happen, regardless if you got that or not, that you are going to be able to do it. Especially if you're into holistic medicate, holistic medicine, you'll be able to do that as well. And even using... The adult bio healers can help you. Who knows? All right. So that's what I vibe for Taurus. Now let me see the hidden truth of the Oracle card. See what I see. I couldn't let you get close to me. What is this Taurus talking about? Is this Taurus afraid? Does this Taurus think if she gets close to someone, she can probably uh, lose the other person she's with? This is what I'm getting. This is what I'm getting. Or... Mm, or she, Or is she holding back? Is she holding back? So it could be three of either she likes to hold back to control or she doesn't like to talk to anyone because she has somebody who she's having problems with or vice versa. It could be a heat. So it's a lot of stuff going on, Taurus. A lot of stuff going on. Okay, now we are going to go however Taurus you can you can fix that everything is fixable right everything is fixable and if you're a Taurus and this doesn't resonate with you remember that we have different signs okay I myself I have a Leo moon I'm cancer with Leo I have a Leo moon I have Aquarius rising so whatever resonates with any of of your you know your houses okay because you could be a Taurus sun, and this may not resonate with your sun. It could resonate uh, Pisces. If you got Pisces moon, Pisces can resonate more. Or if you got Pisces rising, that could resonate with your personality. Because the rising is the personality, right? The moon is the emotions. And the sun is basically uh, who you are, you know? Your makeup. Okay. All right. I, I set it up. Let me... Let me uh, do the bowl for the air signs, okay?
Mm. All right. Air signs. First I got first I got Libra, then I got Aquarius. Okay. Okay. First I got Aquarius. That was the first one. First card I got was a priestess. And priestess generally comes through, you know, good man, good woman. But at the same time, a um, good woman, you know, if it's a man. But, however, I got the priestess and I got the devil card at the same time. Either somebody is going, there's going to be someone that's going to get in trouble with the law. This is what I see, see with the air sign. When I see the devil card, I see the devil card. I see the high priestess card. And I see justice card. This is trouble. Somebody's going to get tr in trouble with the law. If it, And I picked up Aquarius. And this is um, more like they fell asleep and they got caught. And pick up a fight. It's going to be a huge fight. Okay? You have another fight card, Aquarius. Be careful. This is another fight card. But at the same time, more of... Um, creativity as well this is more of creativity um the five of wands but at the same time uh if you look at the card it doesn't look like you know they're having the greatest of times okay you have the ten of wands you are going to be exhausted okay you're going to be exhausted um you're going to be exhausted basically Ten of Wands, working so hard. And basically all your cards, well, you got three ones. You didn't get four. Your cards are, you want to you wanna walk in the right path, but you have too many temptations. And right now, as we evolve to the fourth and fifth dimension, you can't be walking in poor footsteps because you're going to be nothing but tired. There is some monies that are going to come in though. However, there's going to be monies that are going to come in. But let's see what's what's going on. What's the hidden truth behind all this? What's the hidden truth behind all this? Hidden truth, Aquarius. I want you. What does Aquarius want? Aquarius is going through a lot. Okay. I want you. I want you. The right way. I want you. But I want you to want me. Want me to. And I want you to love me. Just like I love you. Ooh, oh, 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 I give you all the love you I want in return, sweet darling. Your happiness is all I need. Oh, it's too bad. It's just too sad that you don't want me now. This card reminds me of that. You want something that doesn't want you. Aquarius. This is the card that I got. This is the vibration I got. I got a Marvin Gaye tune. Okay. Or it could be that you want something you couldn't get your hands on. You may get in trouble. So this is what's going on with Aquarius. This is what I buy. Okay. Let's go on with Libra. However, remember that just because you're an Aquarius, that doesn't mean this is, is this is going to be for you. Because I myself have Aquarius rising. This is not vibing with me. But I'm Cancer Leo and I got Leo. So it's not vibing with me. Okay. All right. So let's go with Libra. And I'm going to do their hidden truth card later. Okay, Libra. Okay, Libra, what am I vibing with you? Libra has been falling asleep a lot, and this is due to sickness. A lot of Libras have been sick. 
Libras have been sick. They're falling asleep. They're almost like in a dream state. They want to just sleep. They don't even want to work. They don't want to work. They're not happy in their job. Um, you got the devil card as well. You got the devil card. Something that you're doing is not right. This is this is these showing and legalities. You're so exhausted because you don't know where that the the next pennies are going to come from. This is what I'm seeing. There's, you know, just like Aquarius, this is kind of absorbing for all the the air signs. There's a lot of confusion there for air. Okay, a lot of confusion because the devil card is there. Then you got the sleepy head card, the sleepy, I call this a sleepy joke card. And you got the high priestess. If the high priestess would have been there by herself without the devil card, then I would have say, said something different. But when you got the devil card and then you got the justice card at the same time, and then you got a bunch of these wands, there's a lot of exhaustion, sickness here. There's sickness. There's... um sickness temptation for libra sickness temptation and monies almost like money hungry okay this is what i'm picking up or basically